do you have any advice for if dislike blank then being a uh, personal trainer is not the right career path for you oh gosh there's so many of those if you do not like people it yeah. is a very people-y industry. I don't, <laughs> there's no way around it. Um, I mean, there's plenty of introverted coach uh, coaches, uh, but you know, you have to be able to manage, you know, when you're on low energy. And if you can't do that, you're going to have a hard time. Uh, if you dislike sales, you're going to yeah. have a hard time, no matter how good of a coach you are. If you can't convey the value that you provide in a meaningful way, they're not going to buy from you. Um, if you dislike um, uh, confrontation, and, and I don't even mean confrontation in a like a yelly kind of way, you're you're gonna have situations where they don't show up repeatedly, and that's a difficult conversation to have. So if you're not willing to learn that skill, you're gonna have a hard time. So those are the first ones that kind of come up for me. Oh no, absolutely! I think those hit right on the head. Um, and then, so let's flip that around. If you do like blank, then being a personal trainer is right for you. Mm. If you like making a difference in someone's life, I, it, it's so funny to me that teaching people how to squat and move more and to eat a little healthier, the impact that that has, like this stuff can come easily to some of us and some of us, you know, haven't struggled and it may not seem like a big deal, but to help someone else, and it is a big deal for them because it doesn't come naturally. And they send you a message that just makes you cry because they are so thankful, uh, you know, for something that doesn't feel like a big deal to you. I mean, it's, it's just crazy. I mean, you're, you're putting people on a path, not just of being healthier for them, but for their families. And so this yeah. ripple effect. So if you love the idea of making a difference, this is definitely a potential path for you. 